Hey guys, what's up? Cryostasis here. It's time for another video. Alright, I want to talk about this awesome week we've been having here on RuneScape. Alright, first off, early Tuesday morning we got the DeathCon 2. If you do the entire event, you will get a DeathCon t-shirt, a DeathCon lanyard, and if you're a member, you'll get the Hourglass. You also get the Living on Borrowed Time emote, which is actually pretty cool. Also, early Tuesday morning, the Wicked Hood was released to members who have 5 or better runecrafting. You got a message saying, hey, come get this from some guy in Varrock. I will be doing a guide slash review over the Wicked Hood either later this week or sometime next week whenever I get the time. 1.5 million bots and gold farming accounts are going to be banned on Tuesday. Yes, finally, the best update of the entire year is finally here. They're saying that they have gotten 98% of the bots and they're going to ban them all on Tuesday when the update hits. And on top of all this, reflection bots are supposedly never going to be able to work again, which is pretty sweet. In celebration of this, Jagex is like, hey, we need to give them some free shit. So, on Tuesday, they are giving us triple Slayer XP all day. It does not go down like it normally does on bonus XP weekends, where it starts out at a 2.7 multiplier and slowly drops down to a 1.1. It's going to stay at a 3 times multiplier for Slayer XP all day long. On Wednesday, we get triple the Castle Wars tickets. Thursday, distractions and diversions. Everything is tripled. Evil trees, shooting stars, familiarization will get... Lucky Charms and Ingredient Boxes instead of having to choose. And Penguin Hide and Seek, you get double points. Oh no, but Cryo, my Penguin Hide and Seek day is Tuesday. That's when I find all my penguins. Well, don't fret. Go ahead, find your penguins on Tuesday. Spend those points. Go find them again on Thursday because they're resetting and get double points for that day. So over the week, you'll basically be, be getting triple the points, which is pretty sweet. On Friday, my favorite day, of course, Soul Wars Day. Hell yeah. We're getting triple zeals all day long from midnight to midnight. I wish I didn't have to work because I would no life the shit out of that. Alright, so basically if you lose, normally you get one zeal, two zeals for tying, and three zeals for winning. Now, you're getting three zeals for losing, six zeals for tying, and a huge whopping nine zeals for winning one game. Games last 20 minutes each. You can get hundreds of zeals during this time. It's going to be awesome from midnight to midnight on Friday. These times are BST only. I don't really know what time zone that is. I'm assuming England. There you guys go. Jagex has given us all kinds of free shit to make up for the horrible botting problem that they've made us put up with, which really doesn't make up for it, but it helps. Non-members kind of got fucked, but the guys got to remember, you guys are getting brand new worlds without bots, without gold sellers. It's going to be like normal RuneScape again. It's going to be freaking awesome. See you guys later. I will be doing the Wicked Hood review slash guide later on either this week or next week. I'm also working on a couple other videos for you guys, so hope to see you soon. Leave a comment in the section below on all this stuff that I've talked about. If you want to read any more of this, go to the RuneScape homepage and check out the bot busting and bonuses for all thing. It's freaking awesome, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.